it doesn't piss me off that I have a private plan. But you know, guys, I'm, go I'm going to show you my stomach now. So this is my stomach. As you can see, guys, I'm still in my figure. As you can see, I'm still shapey. See? See, this is me, guys, now. As you can see, the only problem, guys, is are my stretch marks. They're very... How are you? This is my daughter Rachel and this is my wife Isa. Isa is just going to show you how to cook Yee. sausages. Hi everyone! So welcome back to my channel. This is me Isa and this is Paul taking a video of me. So today I'm going to show you guys um, what I normally cook for my family, especially my daughter when she's growing up and we wanted our baby to become healthy. So most of the time I'm cooking healthy food. And today I'm going to share with you guys what food or what meal or what so-so food I'm going to cook today and or what I'm, what food I'm going to prepare today for my family. So as you can see guys, there's sausages here and I am yep. frying the sausages guys. So for the sausages, I use canola oil guys. I've been using canola oil for many years now and it's a good I, I would suggest or recommend to use canola oil. I've been using this for many years now and well, we rarely get sick. And of course, as you can see, we have six sausages, two for Rachel, two for me, and two for Paul. So what you, you need to do is you have to do this guys with the sausages so that oil come out from the sausages. So and then guys, this is our sausages, and now I'm gonna show you the vegetables. Wait, I'm, I'm sorry, I said, did, did you poke all of them? Yep, I did, I okay. did before that. So now I'm gonna show you the vegetables. So we have our sausage, that's our main course. And then now we have a vegetable, guys. So as you can see, guys, I'm using a rice cooker now. So this is a rice cooker. Usually, that, guys, what, what do, usually what I do with the vegetables is that I steam the vegetables you don't go boiling vegetables guys in the water because once you do that then the water will absorb the taste and uh, vitamins and minerals from the vegetables so much better if you steam the vegetable remember do not boil the vegetable steam the vegetables so here here you go so here guys I've got come here please so here guys I've got carrots and this is sweet potato, and this one is peas, corn, and stringy, stringy beans. So these are all the vegetables, guys, that I'm gonna steam. And it's not yet ready. It's not yet ready. And over here, because Rachel loves to have avocado in every meal, I'm gonna prepare some avocado as well. And over here, guys, our leafy greeny. Greeny vegetables, lettuce, lettuce, Paul loves lettuce. Um, I love lettuce, but not really. And but I love avocado most. Okay, guys. So this is gonna be our dinner, guys. So later, I'm gonna show you how. If, I mean, I'm gonna show you guys if it's all done. Thank you. Hi guys, so now they start. Um, they started eating already, guys. Um, these are just the vegetables that are cooked, guys. Some vegetable hasn't cooked yet, but because Paul is very hungry, Rachel is very hungry, they have to eat first. So over here, guys, there's the sausages, and of course we have a bread here with butter spread, and there's Rachel's favorite avocado, and of course we're having juice, and this juice is what like. 21 oranges pop juice also oh, this is an orange juice guys and of course my lettuce and the vegetables and some vegetables guys are still there stem so we're just gonna wait for them see kain kain happy eating so hi guys so of course everything's done my vegetables done and everything's done and paul and rachel are already done eating guys i'm sorry i'm sorry that we didn't um um take um everything but i've got the vegetables here guys the steamed vegetables done of course i've got my lettuce here I'm, i started eating on actually guys and rachel's um i'm sorry about that and rachel's avocado well they're all done and i am the one left behind so guys that's the kind of meal that suits for our family or that suits for those people that wanted to lose weight Remember, guys, you know, I know most of Philip. I mean, 
Filipino people loves to eat rice. And you know, guys, rice isn't healthy. I don't say that it's bad for us. Of course, we need rice because it's a source of carbohydrates. We can eat rice, but not too much in a day. Usually, guys, I eat rice twice a day. Most of the time, I eat vegetables. I eat vegetables, guys, or maybe like just bread, toasted in the morning and coffee in the morning. And um, less sweet as well. Remember, do not eat too much sweet. You know my husband, Paul, guys? Paul is 115 kg. You know, my his dad, I told him, please, please diet, 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 because it's not good. Because, guys, Paul is sweet lover. Paul is chocolate lover. And as you can see, guys, my husband has a big stomach and he's fat, okay? So, less sweet and less soda. You know, guys, instead of drinking soda, drink juice, okay? Drink juice. So, now, guys, here, I have here um, juice. So, I'm going to show you guys. I'm sorry. So, instead of drinking soda, sometimes, guys, I drink soda maybe once a week or twice a week. Not too much, of course, maybe half of this glass. And I, we drink orange juice instead of soda sometimes, but orange juice. This is really good, guys. If you want to lose weight, do not drink soda. Drink juice. Orange juice, apple juice, anything that is, that's fruit juice. Okay? Also, guys, yes, less sweet. And you know, guys, this kind of meal helped me a lot. As a mother, guys, I don't exercise. I have no time to exercise because I am a full-time mom. And my baby is one year and nine months old already. And I'm proud to say that I still have the body of a woman or a girl that would love to have. You know, guys, like, because there are just two things that's going to happen to you after your pregnancy. It's either you're going to get bigger and bigger or you're gonna get fat or you're gonna get smaller but in my case after my pregnancy guys i lose weight and i went back to my normal body after i mean before before i get pregnant because before i get pregnant guys i am 38 kg this is no lie before i i got pregnant a bit before i get pregnant i am 38 kg then when i got pregnant i went up to 60 i think it's 63 kg so half guys half kilos and rachel is only 2.6 kg guys and you know i got really bigger and bigger guys and when i got pregnant i got diabetes because i love to eat sweet i love to eat rice i love to eat sweetie food so that time i have to get dietitian guys because my doctor told me, please get a dietitian um, to to um, teach you what to do in order for you to um, I mean, in order for your sugar to like low down. Because I am a diabetic pregnant woman when I got pregnant, and it's not really good, guys. If you are pregnant. Being a diabetic pregnant woman is not good for you. And that time, my doctor said, there's a chance that you're going to have a cesarean. And I said, no, doc, please. I don't want to get cesarean because I wanted to experience a nor the normal delivery. And lucky, guys, you know, my, when my water broke. I went to the hospital and I'm still two centimeters dilated. And I said, oh, my God. So there's a chance that I'm going to get cesarean. I said, no, 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 please. So they have to induce me. And luckily, guys, after four hours, Rachel is out. Okay. Normal delivery, guys. No cesarean. And I'm happy with that. But the only problem, guys, that I've got after my pregnancy my body went back to a normal, shapey figure, but I have a lot of stretch marks on my stomach. But it doesn't matter. It's worth it. I don't regret because that means that you deliver a baby, you had a baby, and it's a it's good thing for women because we women, our main goal in this universe is to reproduce. And that means 
you know, we're going to have a baby. We're going to get pregnant. We're going to reproduce a child. You know, we're going to reproduce. We're going to have a baby. We're going to give birth and everything like that. So it doesn't piss me off that I have a private plan. But you know, guys, I've got, I'm going to show you my stomach now. So this is my stomach. As you can see, guys, I'm still in my figure. As you can see, I'm still shapey. See? See, this is me, guys, now. As you can see, the only problem, guys, is are my stretch marks. They're very deep stretch marks, but it doesn't matter. I have a baby and dots. That's all good, guys. So this is the example of the food that you're going to eat. If you want to lose weight, guys, remember, if you want to lose weight, less carbohydrates, less sweet, less soda. So I hope you guys like my video and I hope you guys learn from my video and I hope to see you soon guys remember this is Isa and Rachel is crying behind because I closed the door so goodbye guys bye bye, bye.